Hello, welcome to another episode of Paulie's Kitchen. My name's Paulie and this is my kitchen. In today's episode, I'm going to be showing you how to make cold smoked chicken skewers. Yes! They're going to be so delicious. They're going to be absolutely amazing. My sister bought me one of these for my birthday. It was my birthday recently, and it's a cold smoker, and we're going to be showing you how to use this and how to get the best out of it. Everything that you will need for this recipe is here. So don't worry if you didn't catch those ingredients. I will be putting those in the info box below. So do check out there for those, and you'll catch them there. We'll also be using some of these which is some fresh chicken thighs from the butchers. So guys, do remember to like, comment, subscribe, and hit that bell button so you can find out when I release my next video, which will be really soon. We're going to crack on, we're going to smoke some chicken, and then cook it blowtorch on a hot stove. It's going to be epic, and it's going to be so delicious. So let's go. So the first thing we need to do is we need to get a glass bowl. So what we need to do is we need to peel the skin off, just like that. Should, should. Quite easily. Lovely. Like that. So we don't want the skin, we're just going to pop that there for the moment. So the next thing you need to do is we need to turn over and then we just need to cut the bone out of it. And that's the bone, and we're also going to leave that over there. All you need is to cut that bit off. Put that bit of fat off. So all we're going to do now is we're going to take our chicken and just pop it into our baking dish. So yeah, now all we're going to do is repeat that for the chicken fires. Now that all the chicken's cut up, we need to get rid of the waste and then we need to clean this because you don't mess with chicken. And then we're going to uh, smoke it and while it's infusing with the smoke, we're going to make the marinade. So let's take our chicken and what we need is we need our cling film. So that we've done that, what we need to do is we need to take our cold smoke gun to our wood chips into the top. That's how you smoke chicken. It's a little bit smoky in here. Hopefully my fire alarm doesn't go off. Fingers crossed. But yeah, what we're gonna do now is we're gonna make our marinade. So we're just gonna pop this to the side and let all that smoke infuse in the chicken. So yeah, guys, we're gonna take a glass dish. So we're gonna take some olive oil, just like that. And then we're gonna pour that in. So we're gonna move this slightly across. Take our herbs. Some white pepper. It's nice and fine. Okay. Salt. We're also going to add some chilies in there as well. We've got some fresh oregano here and we've got some fresh thyme. What we need to do is we need to pickle the leaves off of this one. And we're going to pickle the bugs off. Chicken. 
And now that we've got our smoked chicken and we've covered that in our delicious marinade, let's take our cling film. So anyway guys, this is our infused smoked chicken and what we're going to do now is we are going to put this on some skewers. It's got a really delicate hickory smoke smell, lovely. So yeah guys, we've got these skewers. All we're going to do is we're going to thread the smoked marinated chicken fire onto these and then we're going to put it on the hot stone and we're going to blow torch it. So this thing lives at the bottom of my oven. So yeah guys, that's how you make blowtorch, cold smoke, chicken kebabs. That's a mouthful. <laughs> anyway guys, thanks for watching. Do really hope you enjoyed this episode. I'm gonna tuck into these now because they are absolutely delicious. They are so good, you need to make these. But be careful to blowtorch. Actually, don't try that at home. So anyway guys, do remember to like, comment, subscribe, and hit that bell button so you do find out when I release my next video, which will be really soon. But in the meantime, guys, I'm going to tuck into these. Take care of yourselves, and I'll see you again soon. Bye-bye.